Hey guys, it's Sean here, and I am here with two of my friends, Lyth Altala and CyberOwn and Alex19. Hello guys, it's Lef here, and it's Alex, and today me, Sean and Lyth are going to give you our true and honest feelings about the Viand community. Strap and tight because we've got a lot of reasons on why the Viand community has become a really toxic place. Number 1. They cyber bully people for no reason at all that the community sees as a pedophile or a criminal. I've been falsely accused of being a pedophile. I looked up what the actual definition of pedophilia means, and it's someone sexually attracted to children or make them do inappropriate acts. I used to upload sexual content back in 2019 to 2020, but I don't do that anymore and that's what got in my hate base started. 2. Now we're going to talk about the whole pedophile and criminal supporter terms. These terms are also really toxic. Why? Because the Vian community uses it as a freaking excuse to bully users and they always jump to conclusions without any proof or evidence. Like what the hell? Thirdly, like Leith said about conclusion jumping, the Vian community says things without actual evidence. If you are still jumping to conclusions, we highly suggest that you stop before you get yourself in trouble. Fourth, as I've already stated the Vyond community cyber bullies users that they see as pedophiles and criminals, when pedophile and criminal users don't exist, because if a user was actually a criminal or a pedophile, they would have been in prison by now, they also use pedophiles, criminals, criminal supporters, and pedo supporters in the wrong context just because they disagree with what the Vyond community says. Now, we're going to talk about forcing users that you hate to leave the internet. That is just wrong and it's another form of cyberbullying. Like curry joking, it's the user's choice whether they want to stay on the internet or leave. You're not the user's parents, guardians, boss, or teachers. Also, I was forced to leave the internet because of what I did three years ago and I'm not listening to anyone that still tells me to leave the internet because it's my choice, not yours. Another thing we want to talk about the way the Vion community uses criticism and backlash in the wrong context. Now that's just really stupid, because what the Vion community does to Sean, Leith, Jonah Campbell, Jake Kaiser, Wilson Perez, and others is not criticism or backlash. What the Vian community does to them is absolutely rude and disrespectful, if you don't like a certain user, just block them and ignore them. Not only that, but the Vian community cannot handle opinions to those who like me, Jonah, Jay, or Wilson and calls them pedo and criminal supporters, once again, pedo and criminal users and supporters aren't a real word. Yeah! It's just our own personal opinions, thoughts, and feelings, not to mention that the being community gets so triggered whenever someone supports Sean, Jonah, Jay, Wilson or any user they claim as a pedophile or criminal. Also, something else we want to talk about is the jokes. The being community gets so offended about jokes and they attack several users for it. If you don't like the jokes, keep it to yourself. Also, a bunch of users that don't even know you as a person harass the daylights out of you and they cause so much drama without even thinking. And no matter whenever we tell certain users to not cause drama in the Viand community, they start it up non-stop and it just goes on forever. Also, in life, there is going to be drama, and our New Year's resolution going into 2023 is to avoid all drama at all costs. Also, we want to talk about the handle hate term. Some users think the term is annoying. I'm one of those people who think the handle hate term is annoying and pointless. But Epic Beats Gaming gave me some really good advice on how to handle hate in the future, so that it doesn't give the Vyond community ideas to bully and shame me or other users that have gotten victimized by the Vyond community. Also, the whole victim card talk is all stupid, because it doesn't help the person you are targeting nor does it help yourself get any better. Another issue we want to address is that the Vian community has been corrupted by UP members and a bunch of kids who literally know nothing about YouTube. Another thing we want to talk about is the sock puppet accounts. We know someone very well that owns a bunch of fake accounts and doesn't take proper accountability for them. There has also been hate base accounts out of other users, especially me. Also, the Vian community supports cancel culture, why? because they brought up Sean's past while he deleted the Dora and Little Bill having S-word in the bathroom video and Little Bill and a bunch of other preschool show characters showing their private parts video. Sean deleted both videos not to avoid criticism or backlash, he did it for his own safety, as Sean is not the only one that's recently been attacked by the Viand community. Also, several other users have been attacked by this community. 
users include that are not limited to Jake Kaiser, Jonah Campbell, Wilson Perez, Emmanuel Thomas, Super Poisonous Yoshi 1997, and others have been attacked as well. Some users that are not a part of the Vyond community anymore still use Vyond, I'm one of them, and I am out of that cesspool of a place despite that I still use Vyond, sure, what they did was messed up as well as me, but the Vyond community isn't acting any better by talking about them obsessively behind their backs, jumping to conclusions, getting so offended about jokes and vice versa, but some users that get attacked by the Vyond community like me are trying to move on for the better. So to anyone that's still a part of the being community of today, we highly suggest that you get the hell out of there, because it's a complete waste of time and there's really no purpose justifying yourself to a bunch of users who don't know you as a person. Also, one last thing before we wrap up is that some users call certain users hypocrites for not being a part of the Vyond community, but for still using it. Let me just say that Vyond itself is not the issue on why its community has become a living hell. It's all the user posts, drama and controversy going on, and to anyone watching this video, please do not attack me, Lyth or Alex about us speaking the truth about the Vyond community. Yay, we are not going to lie, the Vyond community was once a nice place, but now, it's turned into a clown house in the amount of years, and many users have left that community for pretty obvious reasons, because of all the drama and controversy. But whatever you do guys, please keep yourself safe and avoid drama at all costs, and let's all make 2023 a better year and a more peaceful year. 2022 has not been a good year at all because of all the drama, but if you want 2023 to become a better and peaceful year, then you must avoid drama on all social media, not just YouTube, because social media can become a really toxic place these days. But anyway, that's all we wanted to say here, if you have any questions, let us know in the comments on all three of our channels. Until then, this is a saying, have a good day, and remember, stay out of drama. drama.